the makeup tutorial. So, first things first, always first, clean your face. I'm using Murad and the Deep Sea Cosmetics. I use both of them. Sometimes you gotta do it twice. Just cause it's different, we're not the same. I've got no trouble with my pride, got trouble cutting tight. Okay, step two, moisturize. Again, deep sea cosmetics, um, moisturizer. And I like to use the Nutiva Organic Coconut Oil together. Two squirts. One. Mix that up. And more swear. So it's not soaking up as much of the product. That's my logic behind it anyways. follow up with my primer I'm still using my same elf primer from a long time ago don't even know if it's still good but it ain't empty and I also like to pat my face just a little bit because that's where the light and I don't want it to be too greasy before I even start putting stuff on. Me personally, I like to start with my eyebrows. Because they are the heart of the face. Well, that's what I believe. I have this Wet n Wow Ultimate Brow Pencil. It has the like... Pencil on one end, brush on the other. So I usually just brush out my brows first. Jesus, first. <laughs> I'm starting to think that I pay over for your love. Bear with me, guys. Be right back. Okay. <laughs> My little ones, it was just too hot to function in. <coughs> Had to go, you know, get more comfortable. I'm sweating out my makeup before I even put it on. Where was I? Oh, eyebrows. <laughs> so, yeah. Brush on one end. Pencil on the other end. I like it. Brush them out. And as you can see, my brows are really thick. I go slightly outside the brow and then I clean it up after.
So I know that's looking a little bit werewolfish, but like I said, I'm gonna clean it up. Turn this way. These sisters, not twins. <laughs> so next is um cleaning up these arches with. I actually don't have a concealer. I actually use a really light foundation to do that. These rappers be messy, dude. So I use this Mary Kay Luminous Wear <laughs> Foundation. Um, I'm gonna use just the back of my mirror as a palette. <laughs> Cause I'm a novice, so I don't have any, all these little freaking, you know, all these tools and stuff that everybody else may have. I'm not a professional, I just do this for fun. You just need a tad bit, a tad. Grab my concealer brush. I use two brushes for this. I use the angled eyeliner brush. And then I like to use a flat. This one. Oh, here it is. And I like to use a flat, round, small, flat, round brush. Yeah. Personally, this is probably the most time consuming part of my makeup. Um, because I spend a lot of time on my eyebrows, they are very important and critical to me. I don't know 
why my family act like <laughs> I'm gonna kill them myself if they come through my video. She is crawling on the floor <laughs> to avoid being in the frame. It's not that serious. I appreciate the thought, but geez, it's not that serious. Okay, so after basing all of that out and looking like I have a unibrow, <laughs> there she is. <laughs> I, like, I like to use um, a beauty blender or just a basic little sponge to pat it out. You want to be very delicate with this because you don't want it to end up running over and messing up. So nice, soft, consistent pads will do the job just fine. Let me get the mirror just to be, just to be safe. And I don't know if y'all can notice, but I kind of covered that. So I just grabbed the pencil and I fill it back out. Like so. Yeah. Fill it back up. Same thing for underneath. Try to pat that out smoothly as possible. So with that same foundation, <laughs> I like to base out my eyelids before I do my foundation. I mean my my eyeshadow. Just use a little brush and put it on. No! Try not to be like me and blind yourself with it. Jeez. I'm already having a sinus infection dealing with that. Now I got makeup in my eye. Damn it. <laughs> Don't be afraid to mess up your makeup to save your eye health. All right. <laughs> it's probably still on water for a little while, but we good. All right, back to it. Don't be so rough like me. Because really and truly, I'm not in a rush doing my makeup. Literally just for this video. <laughs> okay. Then I like to use my foundation brush. There we go. 
Okay. I like to use my foundation brush to pat that out. Lift your eyebrow. light base for the eyes okay so my favorite 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 top base would be this middle color here it's like a nice auburn that color and I use that for the brow bone area see that Now do that high area right under the brow. I think real professionals would call this the brow highlight color. So yeah, let's call it that. Okay. So then you gotta go. Well, I like to go. You don't have to. And uh, in this right very corner right here, actually, with this highlight color, I also like to make like a little. See that? Like a little pocket right down. Going from right out there in a little pocket, kind of like a wing. Same thing on this side. You go here and you just push it in right down, like a nice little wing. show you why I do that so after that I like to take a dark brown color I'm gonna mix this shiny I'm gonna mix this shiny one with this matte brown And I'll go right in that little pocket, right there. Like a little circle. 
I'm gonna extend it out just a tad. Well, actually, not a tad. I'm bring it across. So, circle here, bring it across. Okay, and I do it twice. And I have these folds in my eyelids, so I like to try to keep it right above the fold. Like that. Same thing on the other side. See that gradient, that light, then the dark. Okay. So once that's done, I like to hit the inner corners and then lower uh, lid with a light, a light, light shimmer. And what I like to use is my Hustler Baby by Fenty. Hustler Baby. <laughs> Hustler Baby by Fenty. <clears throat> and I don't <clears throat> particularly like to use this one. I use it later to blend. But for this little part, I like the big, flat, rounded, um, eyeshadow brush. This is very pigmented, so you just need like, choo -choo. and you go, I like to go like this, so I can really focus on these areas, because I like to go right, just right in there. See that? Right in the crease. Right in there. I bring it out just a tad bit, like, just a tad bit like that. Same thing on the other side. So after patting that on, then I like to brush it out. Then, that's when I take this back again and try to blend it all together. Just a light blend. Next eyes. So next, foundation. And I have my Fenty Beauty. I'm using the 430 right now. Cause I don't know if you can see the four thirty. Um, Cause that's the one I was using originally. Although I don't think that's my correct shade anymore. I got a little dark, um, but yeah. So it's not squirting anymore. So I like to just use this little thing. It definitely collects the product, and I just like to pat. Okay. 
This more has to do this work. So for the sake of the video, I'm gonna be civilized and pour just a little bit on here. And so since this is the lighter shade, I like to put this in the highlight areas. So I'll pat, pat, right down, right down, down the bridge, bring it in these eye areas. A little bit more. Try not to be like me and make a complete mess. But yeah. All the highlight reasons. So like down here. And this is my Fenty 430. And I know you're like, well, what you gonna do with the rest of your face? Just be patient. <laughs> so then, let's close this back up because I'm making a mess. So then I have the LA Colors Foundation. And I use, which one is this? This is the Black Walnut LM288. And as you may be able to see, this one is more chocolatey, more closer to what I am now. So I take that and I go in my contour areas. Then I mix them together, the residue, and hit the neck area. Just a quick one, two on the neck area because this all blends out. Okay. Then I like to take my foundation blending brush and start blending. Yeah. So next, um, highlight contour, highlight suede, Fenty contour, espresso, Fenty. So. One, two, and I go three, four. When you do like this, it should lead right in there. Okay? I don't do too much contour. Just do some slight highlight. I do a triangle, upside down triangle here. Down the nose. 
eye area. Go one, two, three. Do an X and everything else blends together. Okay. So for contour, I use this angled contour brush. I just want to get in there. Small circles, bring it around, around the eyebrow, lead to that side area. Basically, you're framing the face. Bring it out to the edges. Bring it up. Just like that, lead it to that. Okay. Bring it out. Same thing. Up and out. Then I like to use my foundation brush for my highlight. Just blend it out the same way. Blend up and up. Out. Oh. I got the contour on my nose. That's my most favorite part to contour. Okay. Back in. Like that. Right from the eyes on down. So after that, I have the No Shine All You by, oh, the All May <laughs> Loose Finishing Powder in 300 medium. And I go right in. I go in with my uh, sponge. For those of you who don't know, this is called baking. Basically, it's like setting. Baking, setting, same difference. So while that's setting, I take my big powder brush, powder brush, and I use my RK by Kiss Mineral Powder in chestnut, and I hit those contour areas.
Then, I'm gonna take this little brush, get rid of that. Up and out, up and out. Takes away some of that shine you tend to get with makeup. <laughs> then I go over my face again with that mineral powder. Okay. And also with this little brush, I do my blush. Which for me, I like to use that same color that I used for my brow highlight. Just like a little tap. Smile, smile. Tap, tap. Tap, tap. Out. Bring it out. Make it look a little toasty. Is it, is it that toastiness? A little bit on the nose. Okay. Then I like to take my little angled um it is called a precision contour but I like to use it for a little bit of highlight so for a highlighter going back to my Fenty Hustler baby just a dot that's too much you just want to tap it Boop. and down see it's bright, so you just literally need a tap. Smile, always smile. Connect that right up. That's that's your highlight. Make them brows and cheekbones pop, you know. Lips. Just learn it. Learn it. So I like three different colors. I like a very light color in the middle. A dark red. Outer corners. And something nice, soft, and shimmery to put it all together. And then, 
Gotta hit it with some gloss. This is not mine, so I don't want to contaminate it. Come on. Okay. See those eyes. Oh. And that's my soft glam look. I hope you like this look. And I hope you enjoyed the video. That's all I got. Hope you tried these products. Hope you tried these methods. Had a lot of fun. Hope you had fun. And I'm out. Bye. So I knew I forgot something. Mascara. My face looking bald headed. You <laughs> need eyelashes. Oh, this is L'Oreal Hydra Fuse Luminous Carbon Black. Voluminous, voluminous. <laughs> what a difference eyelashes uh, make. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. All right, John. Now I'm going. <laughs>